got we got a call from DFAC saying they needed a, dep- a deputy's assistance uh, out at this residence. Uh, we dispatched a deputy out, uh, made contact with DFAC that were there. DFAC uh, took the child away from the home. Uh, we then got a report from DFAC that felt like we needed a criminal investigation. We then I personally contacted Rodney Wall, who was a special agent in charge at the Columbus GBI office. We turned the case over to GBI because they have a child abuse specialist that's trained to do these kind of investigations. Uh, GBI has been, in, you know, had it, had the bull by the horn, so to speak, through all of this, and we've just been assisting them doing legwork. Well, I think it's crazy because this is like the first thing that's happened here in Taylor County that's actually caught the news, and I don't believe in that disciplining your children like that. I have two of my own, and I would never lock them up in a chicken coop. Sir, do you have any comments for us? Mr. and Mrs. Franklin, any comments for us? If, if it's true, uh, then uh, first of all, uh, as, a, as a parent, I, I think uh, that's not one way you treat your children, uh, whether they're foster children or your natural children. They're, uh, it's, it's just no... I don't know what kind of punishment uh, would be appropriate. It's not typical of what goes on in our community. We're, we're a, a rural area. People do take care of one another in this rural area. And, uh, you know, we, we were, uh, I was embarrassed as many of my neighbors were over this incident.